Welcome everybody to another episode of Spirit Bearer. I hope you guys have enjoyed so far. If you have, you know what to do. Please hit that like button and all the stuff that's going up here, you know, the whoosh, do that too. And I'll, yeah, I'm actually so excited to just start and get straight into it. So, without further ado, let's get <coughs> cracking. Got everything set up already. <clears throat> so we're back on the island here. I believe we had just collected resources. No, we we had other stuff to do. Build the field. We've done this already, I feel like. Haven't we? Nothing to collect there. So I've been playing a lot of Apex and it just feels like every like little slant I should be able to slide down I've been doing it with Minecraft as well it's very funny let's build that field uh, here we go where shall we put it shall we put it like boom I kind of like that placement let's head to it then pretty easy quick snips Gwen is taking her time as usual. A field. Ha! It's better looking than I thought. There is a little je ne sais quoi to it. Simple, but elegant. Now all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. But you know me, I would kill a pla plastic cactus. So don't take my word on this. <clears throat> anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes in seeds. He has set up shop in Hummingburg, the busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brothers are the founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Yes, this world has a serious problem of dubious business practices. Since I don't know what you... T yeah. Since I don't want you to go get swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once, and his honest dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingburg, then. Wait. <clears throat> Immediately just jumping straight into where we're going, and it's night time. So our ship won't go anywhere. <laughs> um, hmm. I assume this is Hummingburg. <laughs> okay, so I I feel like that was a um, reference, by the way, to uh, Animal Crossing, that um, Hummingburg raccoon shady business. It's, it's Tom Nook. Oh, uh, the the little little raccoons that run his shop. <sighs> can you, yeah, you can. Wow. Looks like she's playing a guitar. And there we go. <clears throat> Let's see what Gwen needs, by the way. Uh, blah 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 blah. Uh, hug mood. Uh, has eaten a meal she likes. Sweet. Don't have to do much with Gwen. We just fish then until... Until our light runs out. Although we might just reach Hummingbug before we even get to night time. Wow, that was a long animation there. I was like, what? Hey, we made it. We made it before we had to... Or did we? Let's see. Yeah, we did. Mm -hmm. Alright. Hummingbird discovered. Is she gonna come with us? Is she gonna magically TP there? I hope so. Does this skip dialogue? Are we speedrunning right now? Am I sped? Sped. Probably over there. 
Oh, take a good look at the shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are mere meant to resonate with the spirit fairy and the Everlight. I've heard this monument has the power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. The two slots on it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you could use obols to activate it, but to get obols you need to welcome more spirits on your ship. I'm sure you'll soon find more lost souls like me. Uh, why you, why you, why you, why you, why you do this? He's hungry. Uh, bro, I just fed ya. I just fed ya! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I wanted to interact with this team. Double jump! Bruh! We need the double jump. The double 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 jump. Whee! This is actually pretty beautiful. Oh! Look at him! He's so cute and chubby! He's a chubby bunny. Ooh. Okay, so double jumping is required to get to there. Good. Okay, she won't... There's Theodore. Go ahead. Take a look at what he's selling. Give... Give... Step right up, potential prospect. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing Humberg, Hummingberg since forever. You'll get the glims, I've got the goods. I've got all the ways to make you spend those hard-earned glims. Step right up. Uh, bye. Mm -hmm. uh, but, uh, but, uh, key for Hummingberg. This key opens the door next to the broken ladder in Hummingberg. Okay. Uh, what was that? Uh, those prices are out of control. I won't let him get away with this. Are you ready to see me obliterate this merchant? Sure. Sick him, honey. Good, let's do this. Theodore, I know what you're doing here, and you should be ashamed of yourself, you panda. People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. <laughs> what? Madam, what's the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fairer, but she's not a newbie. And neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us. But I... I can assure you my business practices are quite above board. Be warned, you treacherous slip-striped weasel. I won't tolerate this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses, just fair prices. I... I... So stop being dishonest at once. And next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. If you start being smarter. Mm -hmm. Got it? But... Yes. Yes, of course. I promise you I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. Mm. Hey, you. Yes, you. Your friend really gave that greedy merchant mm -hmm. some help. You both look like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You'd have to be able to double to jump in humanely high to make it. I guess you could also use the stairs in that house. But some other idiot lost the key. Well, anyway. See ya. Upstairs crew forever! Upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> that is Hilaire Goose. An excellent salesperson always carries what the customer needs. So my well-off patron, what can I do for you? I... Damn, that's an expensive key. Linen seeds, corn seeds, kaffa bean, carrot seeds. Down fee fee. Okay. Uh, let's go for some linen. And some corn. And some kaffa. He sells limestone and wood. Oh, oh that flipping tail. Oh, look at how cute he is. That's so cute. Fantastic. You've got everything you need. I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you. Yeah. Boo. To get down. Wow. Well. Can we? Why do they all smell so bad? It's low kid. So we can double jump or unlook it. There's not much I can see that needs to be like if we got up there maybe, but I don't think you can easily. 
Aha. Aha. Mwahaha. Into the water. 360 no scope. Oh, excuse me. I got some... Oh, cool. Uh... Okay, there's another one in there. A treasure chest. Yeah. Anything else? Nothing much of interest, sir. Okay, so... Uh... Ah, I see. Aha, out the chimney. You can't grab it from the... Uh, what you may call it, by the way. So two obols to double jump here. Uh, yoink. Let's set sail again. So now that we've got linen, what else can we do? I want to try and 360 jump, no scope. Okay, but how do I now activate? Yeah. Uh, key for Stella's cabin, an oval, old shoe, do -do -do -do. it makes you slightly dizzy if looked at for too long. Could be sold. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, how do I plant in the field though? In low? I want to plant. Aha! Linen. We'll plant one linen there. We'll plant. Another linen there, and give it, give it, give it, give it. Oh, she just yoinks out a watering can. Where else have I seen that? Oh, it's like Pokemon. You just swiggity swooty, my watering can comes out my booty. Intriguing ability, if I do say so myself. I want to sleep. Oh, it's already wake up time. Get the frick up, man! Frickety frackety fruk. She's gonna come up here, isn't she? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Looks great. Way ahead of me, Stella. Your thumb is as green as your hat. This boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget that you'll probably have to water the plants once in a while. Don't ask my word for it. Don't. Yeah. Whoa, that's a weird... Don't ask my word for it, though. My gardening knowledge is as limited as my father's and... Whoa, dude. There are some... You'll have to find better mentors than me. Which reminds me... I believe it's time for you to find new people. Mm. Not that I don't love the idea of just the two of us cruising the ocean. Just the two of us. But you are the spirit fairer. And spirit fairers find spirits. And yes, help them fulfill their last wishes, w wishes, however mundane they can be. I've heard of a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I'll bet you like, I'll bet you'll like this one if he is who I think he is. Go, let's sail. What do you need? Why are you happy? She's just so optimistic, isn't she? Stella! I need to cook her some some tings. Uh, I'll cook her something for her hunger, make her happy. I can raw catch a fish in this time. So need to just like slide. That's what I was playing Borderlands the other day. <clears throat> And, oh, I got a hair. Borderlands 2 with my girlfriend again. And I found that 
there is a huge problem with um, with that game, and that is that it doesn't have that Apex ping system. Like, pinging exactly where this loot is, where that loot is, they really should have done that. Um, and, like, also the sliding and climbing is just very intuitive in the other games. Like, in Okay, so I just had a bit of a problem. For some reason, I stopped recording. And basically, you missed me catching lightning. And I met my uncle, Azel. I think he's a toady. I'll show you him now. Um, basically, I had to fish a lemon up for him, so I learned how to dive. Um, I got new stuff to plant. Um, and yeah, Azel's pretty cool, actually. He helped improve my fishing rod. Um, I'll give you a look now. Basically, I can, like, catch stuff more in, like, in a more advanced way. Let's just wake everybody up. So here, you can see... Let's start it up. Um, I'm also not sure why we're not moving. But anyway, so you see it goes orange and then there and then when it's red you have to like let it go let it go see you can't really let them and then you can get like tiger shrimp and all cool stuff like they all cool stuff like they so now we've got our two ovals we can go back to hummingbird and collect the double jump. So this is Uncle Azul. And I'm sitting down. And that's Gwen. Gwen Stacy. And then all of my plants are being planted. Oh, I got a coffee bean. Uh, why did I? Oh, you don't get seeds, you just get coffee beans. Okay. Interim arresting. I did not mean to water that one. Does he needs food? Foods? Must I feed you? He likes berries. Oh boy, I just love food. Keep him coming. I can't get enough of it. Okay. Uh, he gets a hugling. He's the cutest, by the way. Wasn't that great, favorite niece of mine? And then we'll see his mood. Cool. Uh, them be bornicles on my ship. Uh, well, well. Okay, wait, I did not mean to go in there. Have we arrived at Hummingburg? Okay, the boat is not ready, so no, we have not arrived at Hummingburg. Hello? Bong 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 And I'll give the kitty some love too. That's cute. So the little ladder ma thingy bobber. So I know where the second occupant is, by the way. For the um third oval that we'll get. And I think I know what they look like. Dims is Shep. Let's get... Let's unlock that double jump. Acquired. And we can be part of the rooftop club. Gang gang. Now we can double jump. Okay. Not much... Actually, not much air to it, surprisingly. But we can now get to here and join whatever this is. Oh, a vibrant necklace. Nanigans. Okay. Wait, so what am- 
Okay, weird. Whack. I mean, you know I'm gonna be double jumping everywhere now. Oh wait, there's doof. But it's locked. It is locked. Good job. You made it. Wicked moves getting up here. I kinda lied earlier. It's not so great up here. But you're here, so it might be get better. I don't have a membership card for you. You'll be an honorary member of the upstairs crew. I'd show you the secret handshake, but I don't know where your hands have been. Let's Google how to murder birds like him. Ooh, what are you? Is it a shit? Also, can we go in here? Also locked. Okay. Oh, uh, I did not mean to do that. How much does the key cost, by the way? Uh, buy... A key costs 5,000. Sell... Um... Where, where be our trash? We had, like, the... The trash stuff to sell. Okay. Yes, nude. Let's see if there's any cool yoinks up here. There are very some cool yoinks. But it looks like we must. Oh. Wait, we can just. What did we yoink? <gasps> we yoinked some seed. Now we're here. Can you stand on top of the chimney? You cannot. Ooh. Upstairs crew forever. Okay. Ooh. This is a full stracy. It's an ostrich. Um, I wanted to talk to Mrs. Foul Strace. What? Oh. You gave me a search of right. That's cat. He looks familiar. Gaffodil? Is that you? Oh, yes, yes, it is. Ever so silky, aren't you? Then that must mean Stella. Is that really you? What a fantastic turn of events. And is that, is that, and is that your boat over there at, at sea? You've come to rescue me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time it'll be... The one doing the tea I'll be the one doing the teaching. You can bet on it. Let's get going then. We have some lessons to go through. Is she already annoying? Heck yeah, man. Am I going to not do her voice? Heck no, man. <laughs> Bong. Your summer salty big flippy. Bong, 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 bong. It is very much worth buying the, the, the triple, flipple, triple, slipple, triple. I don't know where I was going with that. But yeah, we can definitely hurt ourselves with this. I want to... Go in. I can't go in. I must spec it. I'm in here! Oh, Stella, all this air, all this open space. Yes, I feel I can grow quite nicely here. Look at me, I'm flowering already. Oh, it's a snack. Oh, that is a cool snack. Yes. Oh, getting out of this chrysalis. What a feeling. Thank you, Stella. I don't know if I'm so happy with a snack. Food? Do you need food? Oh, thank you, but I'm not hungry right now. Do you need a hug? <laughs> oh, you're sweet. What a weird... She uses, like, her hand. <laughs> well, well. Will water. Or views. Ooh, 
<clears throat> Lots of watering to do. You don't need to be talking to... Now about the garden. Oh, Stella, don't you think your boat feels a little sad? Well, it sure could use some greenery. As an added bonus, a small garden route could serve as a nice glass room, classroom. I've been thinking about this teaching thing for a while now. It would be called caring for plants from A to, Z to Zalia. Hmm, yeah, it doesn't ring as good once I say it out loud. Maybe I need to work on that name some more. Okay, so we need to go and build you a glass house. Okay. Build. Garden. You wanted a garden, so I was like, totally gonna make you one. I actually don't know about this. We'll place it here and then move some stuff. How do we move again? I to go back and get it again. Okay, I want to yoink you. We'll put you up here. I want to yoink you down there. Uh, what? Incredible. Hmm. That saves space. I might as well do that. Oh wait, what? Why does that not work? Okay. Wait, maybe... Let's see if I... And now... Oh, I see. <clears throat> yes, perfect. Um, turn up. Water it. Can we place more? Place another turn up. No, that was a carrot. This is a turn up. Let's place a carrot. I like placing carrot. Yes, perfect. What a wonderful little garden. You really outdid yourself, Stella. Well then, that makes us just about ready to start on the first lesson. Make sure there are some seeds in these plots. They'll be important. Let's see now. For our first lesson, we'll start with something I've been quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules, as you probably noticed already. I've always been a preacher for love towards all living beings. For you see, a garden is a vessel of our love, a mirror we should... Oh, yeah. A mirror we hold to ourselves. This seems truer now than ever. Back on my island, when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers. And as I expected, they grew much more vigorously. Through trial and error, I've managed to write a little song. The plants seem to react particularly well to it. I want to further test that observation with you. Go inside the garden and try playing that piece of your cross. Alright, we'll do it. Next to hold your guitar. Okay, so we go A, B, B, A, A, B, 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 A, A, B, 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 X, X, A, B, B, X, X, A, B, B, A, A, B, 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 A, A, B, B, A, B, X, X, A, B, B, X, X, A, B, B A A B B B A A B Is the cat singing? That is the cutest dude. A B B X X A B B A A 
B B B A A. Okay, it seems like the more you do this, the the faster they grow. They can grow a lot. And it's quite lenient with how big the hitboxes are. I don't know how you quit. I'm just here forever now, I guess. But, uh... That's quite cute. That one's incredible. Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you entertained them? Isn't that fabulous? As I suspected, emotions in this world manifest themselves much more vividly. Well, make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows, other passengers might know how to play some music too. They might help if in a good mood enough, if in a good enough mood. Speaking of which, in all the commotion of the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. The strange coin has been tickling me since I've arrived here. I'm relieved it's not one of those pollen allergies again. <laughs> I hope that voice annoys you as much as it annoys me. Stella! Oh yeah, I forgot to water each of these. And Gwen's calling me. Stella! You did good! Now we've got a real boat going. And you'll have to take care of these new passengers now. They'll be the ones testing your patience, not me. But before all that, I have something to ask you. You might have noticed it by now, but sleeping in the guest house is not the ideal scenario for any of us, especially since it's getting crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. You've been terrific up to this point, and it would be terribly rude of me to blame you for anything, but I think it's time for me to have a space of my own. A nice little house, unpretentious, but sophisticated, with a cozy vibe. A space in which I could read and unwind far from the turmoil of the deck. Oddly enough, I'd seen see something with an I'd see something with an alpine flair. See, even I can be filled with nostalgia sometimes. Again, I won't be pushy on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build it for me. Gwen's Lodge. I am the mountain. I mean sure. I'll build that for you, but I won't be happy about it because it takes up so much space. And it's like unrealistic. There you go. Enjoy. Do I like the snake's voice the most? Yes. Am I going to go and visit her house immediately? Wow, it's so empty. It sleeps with cucumbers on her face. So weird. Are people so weird? I wish there was an entrance on the top. Yay, we have surveyed. Surveyed the gummy. Ooh. we've been going for about half an hour now just over not bad i think i'll make this a long episode for you guys we'll get a little bit further further oh yeah i'm supposed to ring the boom wake up you little grubs get out I need a water. And then I need a harvest. Schwank. Schwank. 
And then I need a plan. Oh. Let's play some corn. Because nah, 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 nah. <laughs> the snakes, like what you call it, has just gotten to me. Oh, right, it needed water? No, it did newt. Now Gwen wants to talk and the snake. Stella, I don't want to disturb you with this, but for the last several weeks I've been having strange dreams. They were of a giant snake and of a menacing reefs and of rotten fruit. And since joining you and your crew, well, they've been much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea or maybe the mystical energies of the Eberline. Anyway, I'm now convinced my dreams have been visions. And furthermore, I think they might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. I have been looking at the map in your cabin. My eyes kept being drawn to a specific spot that I marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it away. That that frogger just was like, I'm super jump. Oh, I want some. Oh no, no, no. Stella, don't you remember? I didn't need any animal product. No breast milk, nor ova. Abo. Certainly they were not meant for our consumption, and that me? no, no, I'm sorry, I won't impose my choices on others, but I cannot eat that. Have some popcorn. Has ha been uh, having unsettling dreams. Um. This guy just keeps on jumping, dude. He do be jumping, though. Oh. And water. Cooking water, water and cleaning. I could play music for them, but I don't think I will. This cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo on Waverly? Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. Why you... Why? Why? Is hunger... He's had that. I actually needed to make pepcorn, didn't I? Sprout, I took a look at your blueprint station. It's nice, I suppose, but you know what would be make it even greater? More plans, bigger buildings, better pencils, I'm just saying. I'm sure Albert at Albert at Albert's shipyard could help you out. Um Okay, so she's hungry. Um Improve. Okay. Interesting. Um, so I've gotten two requests now. Uh, this guy. I mean, he's a dragon and we've already been to Albert's, so we might as well get these unsettled vision. Boink. I should be doing something productive, shouldn't I? We're going through the rain again, so hopefully I can show you what a storm looks like. These fusion mechanics. It will be fusion though. Sprout. Jeez, you got to love the sights here. The sea, the blah 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 Uh what do you need? Is hungry Third, have one of that. Hmm. 
I'm not gonna go to Gwen right now. More fusion. Is this how the whole game is gonna go? You just foosh? Hey, I got a medium glim bottle. Not sure what that does. I got me a squid. A squid. I kind of want to see this quartz dragon. I'm I'm excited. Ooh. Come on, give me the squid. Okay, fine. We'll do this then. Jellyfish. Yeah, they come again. Ah, I don't feel great. Go. I still have faith in you. I'll watch from inside. Don't be scared, Stella. They'll be coming straight for us. Okay, let's see where and warm. I see them. Nope, didn't get that one. Oh, so we're done cooking. Holy sherbet, they are high. See, this is kind of what I was afraid of, is building the, the thingy too high like this would end up in really hard looting. Like how, how do you get that one up there? How do you even up, up get there? Are we done with the jellyfish now? Looks like it. Let's go to the kitchen. Hey! Let's cook some pack corn. Actually, let's cook some cafe cafe. Hey, it's actually rather quick. Please tell me, literally just coffee. No, I know you don't like it, blah blah blah. No, okay, yes. <laughs> there we go. Doesn't like Atle's banging. Don't need to be wild no more. Ooh. I feel a rumble on my shoe. Oh, ass. I thought that might be uh, the dragon. I guess it is inevitable that it would be here. Follow me, following me, always even in this world, our destinies, well, they're intertwined, are they not? 
Still, for all the harm it has done me, it looks quite in pain, doesn't it? The rocks on its back seem to be oozing with corruption. Perhaps chipping away at them might soothe it. Go ahead, Stella. All creatures deserve love and care. Do what you do best. I just killed the boost. Oh, oh no. How did that work? Interesting little platform section here. There's no time limit to this. It's like such a relaxed game. Like, any exciting music doesn't really... Or like, scary, like, adrenaline-filled music doesn't need to be in the game. Did I yoinks you in the head? Yoinky boink. Oh, I can't. I can't land on him. Incredible. It looks relieved, doesn't it? I wonder what it means. If we are even to cross the ever to cross this dragon's path again, I think we should help it. However, I might feel about it. For now, though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. Why, 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 what's wrong? Has witnessed the dragon from her past. I'll give you a hug. Aw, oh, you're sweet. Do you need phone? Oh, thank you, I was quite hungry. Goodbye. Don't care about you. Okay, can build a loom on this ship. Okay, let's go build a loom. We cannot. You cannot build a loom here. Give it up. Let's go and put some stuff in here. Uh, cook. We'll cook some popcorn. Because we know that we need to give her popcorn. The squid is gonna take four, five ever. So we can go and take a nap. <laughs> Well, that's a little bit of a glitch. Did y'all see that? That was a bit glitchy. I think... Let's go and see what we can do at Albert's. Albert's, and maybe call it for today. Or... I don't know if I'm feeling Albert. Albert Shipyard, let's... Although that is like our... A request of the day. Hey, squid skewer. Oh, we haven't rang the bell. 
Ring my bell. Yeah. Ring my bell. Wake up. Wake up, you lazy deer. Mm hmm. You know, uh huh. Well, if you uh, can build a loom on this ship, this could be a great for me to teach you a few tricks. Uh huh. So you should definitely add a mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Just check in your blueprint table. Okay. You want food. Let's give you popcorn. And a hug. Are those three ears? Or is it just like... What's your mute? Your mute. Uh... And I can't give you nothing. Hey. Is there anything that we need to do? Nope. So we could see... What a loom costs doesn't look like we could improve. Uh, wool bookcase. Okay, so there's not much we can improve. And we still can't seem to find a loom. Excuse me, interesting. What's wrong? Is hungry. Mm. This guy just eats whatever, <laughs> it seems. Um. Okay. Mm. I guess to Albert we shall go. Mm. Boom. And then we'll go and head out to get more resources. I must admit, like, on the travel time, there isn't much to do in this game. And now that we've sort of got a, a good surplus of food... Another squid. Are we cooking anything, by the way? We are not. Well, we're gonna need to cook something for the snack. Very soon. Is this done? Oh. Perfect. Sea trash. Quick, jump in the water. There's wreckage. I'm sure you'll find some helpful materials in there. Okay. Okay, so you can collect the shells. Okay, that's like a tough one to collect. Cool, so you can collect the barnacle shells. Oh, hectic. I don't know what I did there, but it gave me a lot of stuff. Shwink. Uh, coffee beans. Linen. And we'll call it a day. Does this guy want to sing? 
There seems to be quite a few new faces aboard. I like it, don't get me wrong. I just want, don't want you to forget about your old uncle Atle. You know me, I'm Mr. Personality. I can get along with anyone, anywhere, anytime. I just didn't think I'd have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry, I'll be alright. Sorry I even brought it up. I'll just go stand on the edge of the boat and take it in the splendor, you know. Hopefully no blugs will fly in my mouth. That's no fun. Weirdo. Wong. Hey, can you, like, speed it up? I wanna... You cannot. Tapping, contrary to popular belief, does not make it go faster. Okay, we need to really get to our destination, because... Boy, is it slow. Why are we not moving? Or are we? We are, it's just very slow. Come here, Mr. Snake Lady. Um, yes, I do have something else. What the heck? I'm glad I gave her that voice. Okay. What the heck did I just encounter? Why, why you know? Hello there, young lady. I guess you must be the girl's bird for all. I'm going to make your acquaintance and Francis. You can say I'm sort of a rundling merchant. See, I'm very thorough, fond of things. Objects, curious, chuck, kiss. I just buy everything. Simply put, I will buy anything you don't want anymore. So you've come across a few valuable treasures already. So tell me, what is it? Do you want to port? Let's sound. Hot dim. It is a lot of cash. Mm. Make a lot of cash off of that. We can actually almost buy the key. Won't sell that. Won't sell that. Won't sell that. What is that? Won't sell that. Wait. What have you got? Aaron. Uh, wait, what? Daily quest. Bah. What do you have to sell? An odd seed. Maybe I should buy that odd seed. I'll buy one odd seed and a few of them. I'll buy all of them. Thank you, old man. Kinda like him. Yeah, it's my name Francis. <laughs> That's how his his accent sounds. I'm gonna forget all of these accents by the like by I'm done. But this is pretty fun. Stella! I've been getting your mail here for the past month. I'm not a post office. You need to add a mailbox to your boat. If I get one more letter filled with glitter, I'll lose it. I'm warning you. You might be a customer, but I'm Reserve the right to yell at you. Get it done. Mm hmm. Uh, upgrade. Hobbyists. I could. What do I need for this? Linen thread, lightning in a bottle, maple plank. I have no idea where to get a mapel plank. Uh. Yeah. I just super duper upgraded, super trooper duper upgraded. Like, let's see, 
what we can do. Boobarang. Uh, build sawmill foundry loom. Uh. Let's build it up here for now. Sawmill. Smelt your ores into ingots. Okay. Uh, edit. Boom. Are you serious? It's like one, two, two big. Let's see if we can fit it all in. Does that work? It does. Does this work? It does. Wait, does this work? It does! Hey, so now we've got like a tiny box there. And a loom. I'm going bananas on this ship. I don't have anything to do. I've got the surplus of energy. Wait, I need to get my hands busy. Can you do me a solid? You've always been my favorite niece. You know that. I think I need a place to focus that energy. In a sawmill. Yeah, you're just missing some of the key components, materials, which I'm sure you can find on nearby islands. I'm counting on you to help me out. I'm sure you don't want your old uncle to sleep on the deck, right? Okay, let's see. All right, the lo this loom is this loom looks fantastic. Don't be scared; it's in perfect working order. Let me show you how it works. You put fiber inside, and then you spin. You just have to make sure you hit the target, and you get a little extra if you hit the mark needle. See, pretty easy, right? Now you try it. Try it with this fiber. Okay, uh... Wait, what? Uh... Now let's see. Okay. Hey. Okay, it's not too hard actually to hit the middle each time. Damn, I think I just got a lot of... See, it's not that hard. The machine does all the work, you just have to flow with it. And that's what makes this so soothing. The rhythm, the sound, the feel of it. Utterly satisfying. I'll probably give it a go. Give a go at it myself when you need it. Don't, don't need it. But don't worry about the materials, I'll manage. Cool. I've been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No mm. sorrow, no hate, no relief, nothing. It didn't really matter to me, but it mattered to you. You spent three days crying in Aunt Petunia's room. I bought you three sisters and gave you that damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mum mm. was appalled, but you felt better. I've long wondered why you were so sad, and the best thing I could have come up with is that you were sad in my stead, feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Okay, everybody wants a piece of Stella now that the ship's been upgraded. Uh. Hey. I don't know if you've noticed, but I have been very tired recently, and I'm afraid to say that it's starting to weigh on my morale. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I think my guest house, as lovely as it is, might not be very good for me. It's a bit too noisy and quite crap. I hate to ask this of you, really, but could you maybe arrange for me to have a little private space on the boat? I think it would help out tremendously. And then we could continue our lessons, but nothing too fancy. Just a place to sleep and meditate, with lush greenery, perhaps. Oh, and I'd be delightful if it had natural stones yes that would be splendid thank you again stella deeply okay 
Wow, I'm not picky at all, but I just need all of those. I think this is where we will... Oh wait, that needs watering now, doesn't it? Wait, so didn't I get a mystery seed or something? Or something? Odd seed. Let's plant it. Okay, um... What does Snakey McSnake need? Build... Housing... Ah. Oak plank and limestone. Okay. For today then, we shall call it. Thank you very much guys for watching, I hope you did enjoy, and if you did, please remember to leave a like, subscribe, share, and hit that bell notification button. It helps me out a lot, and I think with new series coming in hopefully very soon, um, you know, the bell notification will help you guys out, and it'll help me push my content, so you know what to do, and I'll take you guys in the next episode. Cheers!